I love mail day. We just got some packages. We got our twin Z pillow and we got a swing and our two rock and plays. And Alex, Stop. he's embarrassed because he's in his thermals, but I think he's cute. No, and he's going, <laughs> he's going to fit it together. So I know how useful bobbies are for babies. And I was looking online, and this is called the Twin Z Pillow, which I think is totally awesome. So instead of getting just two bobbies, I ordered this. And so it'll be cool because both boys can lay in it. They can do like tummy time in it. Um, and I think this is the coolest part. Hopefully, this, I'll be able to tandem nurse them. That is the goal. So I wanted to show, so you, I think this is so cool that this has that purpose. And then you buckle it. And then you have a place to lay both babies and nurse them. So I'm really excited about this. I think it's going to come in handy. And I think it'll be a cute place even just to, lay them in to take pictures and everything, so I'm excited. Jinx tested out our crib, so now he's testing out the rock and play. I just can't even handle how good a big brother you are. And how darn cute you are. I seriously feel like I could record him all day. And I feel like once the boys get here, our vlogs are just going to be like, all of them like sleeping and just laying there because it's the cutest thing ever. I just can't even handle it. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to smile. Well, I can't move my face. I know. Couples who do face masks together stay together. We've been at the doctor's office for almost two and, two and a half, half hours and we still haven't even seen the doctor. So, Alex. Long time. I think I cut you off. Alex jumped ship about an hour and a half ago or so ago because he had to go to work. So it's just us. We've tried to find just about anything to entertain us in here and it's not a lot to pick from. Not much. We've already seen what was in the cabinets. Nothing exciting. No diapers. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, mom said I Need Look for read. diapers. Yeah, <laughs> read them for diapers. But we can update you on the boys. So both babies are doing good. One is uh, Noah is one pound five ounces. Noah one pound five ounces. Liam one pound two ounces. And they both gave us great profile pictures today. So let's see. This is sweet little Noah. And that is Liam. So you can already see the resemblance. Am I right or am I right? <laughs> uh, so a few days ago, Jinx, uh, Jinx got real sick and um, he took a real bad turn for the worst. And, uh, and, and we had to put him to sleep. And so it's been, it's been pretty hard. It's, uh, it's been real hard, especially for Megan, since she's had to be home all the time, and um, and we both really miss him a lot. But um, we we'll just start crying. Yeah, that was the last footage we had of him. I don't want to talk a whole lot about it because I'm it's still just fresh and hard. But thank you for all the prayers. I definitely appreciate them and can feel them and still send them my way if you don't mind. My parents are letting us borrow Cooper so that our house isn't so alone and I'm not alone and it's not so empty. And so Cooper has really helped having somebody here whenever Alex is at work. So I'm thankful for that. Cooper is a He's a healing dog, and we love him. And I'm thankful I have a little couch buddy, just like Jinxie was. This hair is just sticking up saying hello to everyone. I need to mention that at my 23-week doctor's appointment that she measured me and said that I am measuring 30 weeks for a singleton. So I'm measuring seven weeks ahead of, I guess, the normal. 
and I am definitely feeling that. I feel very huge, and as promised, I know I needed to be better about doing more like bump dates, updating on the baby bump. So I'll show you. I'm gonna have to do an Amir selfie for now, but here is the bump. I don't even know if this camera really gives it justice. I guess this might be better to show it with my tank top, but it is definitely getting very big, very uncomfortable. And what totally blows my mind is that now I'm 24 weeks, but it blows my mind that I'm only going to get way bigger. So it should be interesting. Thank you so much for all of the prayers and just the sweet words. Um, it's definitely been one of the hardest weeks of my life. Um, my heart still just aches and hurts and, and longs for jinx. Um, but I really am truly grateful that I got to be his mommy and um, got to have him as my first son, my first son. So I'm going to end this video with some pictures of him, just a few pictures, and we'll see you all next week. I love you all.